Hi, welcome back to No Green Onion. Nobody is home this afternoon, so I'm gonna make fried rice. Basically, I'm gonna select every ingredient I have and mix it with rice. The first one is the carrot. I'm gonna cut it into smaller pieces. What do you usually cook when you're home alone? In Vietnam, I usually walk to the food court to eat something. But in Australia, because I don't have a driving license and everywhere is far from home, so I'm kind of lazy. But on a weekend, my boyfriend usually takes me to Vietnamese restaurant to eat bún bò. Okay, second ingredient is bok choy. Let's chop it. The most important ingredient is garlic. Cross the garlic so it's easier to peel the skin. Do you love the tasty smell of garlic when it cook? Me? I love it. I always use garlic whenever I cook. Okay, cross the garlic again after peeling it. This is honey flavor beef sausages. I'm going to use two sausages to cook. Now I'm going to slide the sausages. To create the beautiful yellow color for the rice, I'm going to use one egg to cook with it. Put some pepper and fish sauce to make it tasty. Scramble until it look like this. Okay, you turn on the stove. Put everything we've prepared into a pan and stir it. It smells good. It looks good. We're done. Here's no green onions, fried rice. Voila! It's dessert time. I'm going to make creme brulee. Creme brulee is a classic French recipe with four simple ingredients. It includes eggs, whipping cream, sugar, and vanilla extract. It is extremely easy to make. It has super rich texture and such an amazingly delicious dessert. Creme brulee is a French word for burnt cream. Okay, we're gonna use seven to eight eggs and only use the egg yolk. Okay, we're using 100 gram of sugar and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Keep mixing. Keep mixing a little bit more. You're getting there. Mix 
it until the sugar is dissolved and the mixture is the pale yellow. Okay, now we're gonna use the whipping cream. We're gonna need 600 ml of whipping cream. And then we're gonna heat the whipping cream up. Turn on the oven and put it on bake 150 degree. Place the ramekins into a large roasting pan. Turn off the stove when the whipping cream is a little hot like this. Slowly pour the whipping cream into the mixture and mix it up. Fill two thirds of the ramekins. Now we're gonna need hot water. Carefully pour the hot water to reach half of the ramekins. Put the roasting pan into the oven and bake it. minute carefully remove roasting pan from the oven put it on a tray to cool down Burn the whole sugar surface. And enjoy! Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos on No Green Onion channel. Like and subscribe because it's free! Bye.